What is up, risk takers? Welcome to the Kill Pete strategy. I am Pete. I am a top player playing Risk Global Domination on PC. I have a daily release schedule on YouTube. I do this show, Fix Friday, every Friday. I do the Waiting on Your Best Behavior podcast in the middle of the week and every other day. I do whatever I feel like if you are interested in getting better at the game of Risk. I invite you to subscribe to my channel. Come along the ride with me. We are doing Fix Friday Live and we got six people, so let's go, let's go. Um... I like to, and I have been, doing these Fix Friday games live on Twitch. Um, it gives me the opportunity to have some interesting conversations while I play. So, um, we lost one player. So we're going to be playing a five-player fixed game with a bot. Settings are, as usual, world domination. Uh, classic map, auto setup, 60 second turns, expert AI, fixed cards. We have one balance blitz dice with no fog, no blizzard, no alliances. I'm in the fifth position. The only player to act after me is the bot. In the first position, we have Marlin Steel 30, flying the flag of Finland with 829 hours, 404 wins, and 922 losses. Quite good. In position 2, we have General Deadeye, 101, 46, flying the flag of Norway, with 44 hours played, 24 wins, and 37 losses. Not a ton of hours, but a great record. In position 3, we have Panda's Revenge, flying the flag of the United States of America, with 236 hours played, 78 wins, and 259 losses. Not too shabby. In position four, we have Lex Terminator flying the flag of France, 243 hours, 80 wins, and 222 losses. And this is the fixed account Bird Blitz from Bangladesh, 23 hours played with an even 21 and 21. I'm looking to get my winning record today. We've tried for this a number of times. I guess I'm not quite good enough at Classic Fixed yet. And in position six, we have an expert AI. All right, so let's take a look. I have a play for Australia because I go ahead of the bot. I could take that three. Hope the bot puts troops elsewhere. I like it. I don't love it. You guys have seen me get burned going for the Australia play a number of times. Howdy, cowboy. How are you, man? Howdy, chair. How are you guys doing? What's up, guys? Yo, yo, yo. Think I should go for Australia this time, or have I not learned my lesson yet? <laughs> so it's only a bot, right? I'm not fighting a human. I'm going to get the six troops, so that's going to be uh, an 8v3. I think I do go for it. I hope to get lucky. Start with the turn one Australia play. That's going to piss everyone in this lobby off, though. At least the bot is there and I'm there, so unless Orange goes ham on I, I think I go for it. Absolutely, you get Oz here? Well, thank you, cowboy. So how did that uh, Canada Advance Fix game end yesterday? Actually, I wanted to talk to you about that. So, you seemed to know exactly how I was going to react when I got slammed into. You're like, oh, Pete, don't, uh, don't suicide into him and bot out. But, like, is that what I do? Because if a player, and this player shall remain nameless, um, slams into me, Ruining their game to ruin mine, my game is over, right? So what is the message I'm trying to send in reciprocity? And I figure that message is... Oh, the bot, the bot breaks me. You see? You see how I get fucking burned for Australia? The fucking bot breaks me. <laughs> Look at that shit. Ah, well, maybe I suck it fixed. Um, ooh. Ooh, I don't love that. I got a bunch of four stacks all over the board, but that's not all that useful. At the moment, whoo, fucking bot. Um, although you're also attaching a flag to your asshole and running down the streets. <laughs> Australia for the win. Thanks, Gando. Yeah, I don't know, right? I don't know what the correct thing to do is. I do value my time. So if a player is going to sacrifice their game to ruin mine, I don't feel like I owe them the respect of continuing to play. Um, but maybe you guys think about it differently. Cowboy says, I think, however, you could have tried to play it out anyways. It was hurting you, but you weren't done for until the rest, till you did the rest of your troops in. But I also do understand why you won't play non-games. All right, put it to you this way. What percentage of public games that you play with me do you see people ruin their game to ruin mine? Because I have an intuition about what that percentage is, but I'm curious to know what your intuition is. Regardless, it's quite high. 
So, and, and that's fine, right? It's, it's, it's part for the course if you're in the kind of situation that I'm in, right? Where I'm very interested in making this type of video to try and teach people how to get better at the game. Yeah, 30 to 40 percent. Yeah, see, it is about 30 percent of my games, at least as far as I can tell, um, that somebody makes a game ruining play that doesn't necessarily benefit themselves. But hey, people are free to play their best game, right? This bot is going to fuck up my shit. I think I lose this game quickly. Unless I get a lucky set. Or unless Orange just stacks with fours and doesn't get a take. <laughs> all right, that's possible too. All right, all right, all right. Well, how's everyone doing today in chat? I hope you are all having a fantastic Thursday. Yeah, that's right. I'm doing Fix Friday on Thursday. I wonder how many of these I'm going to get. I'm heading it off, right? Guys, Fix Friday Live, except on Thursday. Um... <laughs> Man, down to 16 troops. Here's hoping nobody hits my stacks in NA. I saw a big ol' yikes. We're going for cards at this point. Horsies? Ugh. Not so good. Cowboy says, actually, I could give you an in-depth analysis of why you get hit more frequently than others. You probably know part of the reason. Oh, yeah? Please tell me, Cowboy. What is what is your in-depth? I love. You know I love your in-depth analysis. Hey, Panties is here. What is up? What is up, Panties? Hey, why aren't you playing in the 3v3, man? You're not around? One hour till game time. What are you doing? You wanted to play, so why don't you play? You have something else going on today? I would I would gladly sit out if you want my seat. And fucking Nacho said he wanted to go to bed, so I'm sure he'd be happy. You guys couldn't start an hour earlier. I don't know. I can start. I'm flexible. I don't know about these guys. The, their team, the problem with their team is, uh, who are we playing? We're playing Spike, Olive, Sterling, and Sin. And, and Sterling is across, uh, across in England, so it's, uh, I guess maybe it was his, his issue told Misty, but I don't know about the rest. You didn't post in the fucking in the chat here. You should have just said, let's go an hour early. Or I don't know. Whatever. I As I said, I'm, I'm happy to, to sit out next week. We'll get you in. Worst case scenario, right? Orange player does not seem to be doing anything that makes sense, but I want to play with you. Well, that's that's true too. I'm, I'm enjoying the 3v3 so far. We got fucking smashed last week. Did you see? <laughs> we got fucking smashed. They were fun games, though. I almost won one. Got abs Yeah, you got absolutely destroyed. I know. I know. It hurt my feelings. <laughs> you were baffled? I don't know. Did, did you see obvious mistakes? That we could learn from and make this a, you know, make this actionable in a positive way. Yeah, look at the scumbag fucking move Green's trying to pull. Just waiting to snake me out. Cowboy says, so Pete, you are aware of the philosophy of show, don't tell, correct? The biggest thing is that you create content daily. Additionally, you're kind of the face of the competitive side of Discord in relation to risk. You continually promote tournaments and show up in events, right? Which is why people slam into me, because they're afraid I'm going to kick their ass. <laughs> hey, minimum wage clerk, what is up? Hey, Hacker888, how are you guys doing? What's up, what's up? Yeah, it looks like Magenta's ready to take all this as well. We got all these predators hanging out, waiting to fuck up my shit. Okay. So White's going to help pare down the bot in Africa. 
would be my guess. Tries to get an easy take out of their two in Europe. Can't see an Asia instead. I'm at 18 troops. They're at 39. Look at the discrepancy. I get eaten. How many counts do I have in risk? I have five. So I have my main, which is mostly free for all progressive, but a bunch of whatever when I started out. Um, I have my 1v1 account, which is currently ranked number seven. Um, I have Isambard, which is my anything goes account where I just fuck around and play ranked without any real worry. Um, I have this, Bird Blintz, which is classic fix. I'm trying to get to Grandmaster, currently a master. Um, and then I have the new rank up account, uh, Chiquita Grinface, where I am playing free for all progressive world dom, uh, six players unfiltered. Five. Uh, Cowboys. So this is where, this is what leads to perception. Most players would believe you are one, if not the best players. You could tell them that Sterling, for example, has won a thousand FFA games, but that means nothing to them because they see your daily up uploads and your ridiculously good win rates. Right, so the fact that I am trying to help people get better actually increases the likelihood that players ruin my games. Okay, so fair enough. Um, so if you were me, how would you respond to that? says additionally if you're a fan of someone and manage to beat them at what they love that makes you a big target they don't even need to win the game just killing you is a huge yay moment even if it's misplaced yeah well that seems um inconsiderate to me but i don't know that the player that we were talking about yesterday specifically um is a fan or um is all that concerned i i'm, I'm actually confident that player thinks they're better than me so it might not be the case in that case They see their troops finish off Mr. Top Player Pete and get happy. Yeah, that's fine. So I bring it on myself in a way. That's fine. I'm happy to give to this community. Now I lose. Now I lose Australia. He's coming in. He's slamming in. No? Not yet? I'm shocked. Well, I'll, I'll trade. I'll trade the horse trade, I guess. Fuck. Pete, your hair is magnificent today. Thank you, llamas. I quaffed it just for you. <laughs> Cowboy says, well, that's very possible. In that case, it's also absolutely possible they want to prove that by killing you. Yeah, I think the only thing I did wrong in that game was I left too early. And I should have waited until the next turn and slammed into that person again, making sure they died. That was, in retrospect, the thing I did wrong. If you slam into me, and I, can, I am happy to say this publicly, if you slam into me and ruin my game to not benefit yours, I will make sure you die, and then I will go and do something else with my time. Because <laughs> I play a lot of Risk, and I'm interested in games where players are playing to win, and if you're not playing to win, that is a whole different strategy set for free-for-all. That is relevant and impactful, but it's not the type of game I want to be playing. I think I'm okay as long as Magenta doesn't just straight up fucking knock me. Green might also have a line to it, though. That's why I think I trade here. I think I trade here and finish the Oz. Because four stacks in, in NA keep me alive. Cowboy says, speaking of which, I have a whole different can of worms to DM you about after your stream. Oh, I can't wait. I mean, we, you, we can chat now. It's fixed, right? I Fix doesn't require my full attention. It's a nice, slow-paced, slow relaxing risk game. Um, I'm also doing my uh, 3v3 in uh, 45 minutes. And we are playing a very scary team. Spike all of Sterling and Sin. So we got shut out. 
uh, last week. I'm hoping we don't get completely eliminated this week, but you never know. <laughs> you never know how the cookie is gonna crumble. You'll kick ass tonight? Thank you. That's the team. Possibly not against those four. Oh, yeah. Penny says, I mean, I could do the 3v3, but I'll just not sleep. Well, it's up to you, but um, I know Nacho said he was happy to sit out, so you make the decision, Panties. I'm on, my team is is myself, Misty, Panties, and Nacho. So the, la the three of us last week were me, Misty, and, and Nacho. I think Nacho has some sort of uh, night shift sleep schedule as well. Hey, don't let me twist your arm, but if you're still up. I was says, nah, I'm kidding. I got belief in you, dude, but either way, just have fun. Yeah, I'm gonna. I found I found it fun, even though we got we got fucking smashed. I found it quite fun. It's not looking good for green. But does magenta kill green? Looks like they're not quite lined up to do it. Don't do it, magenta. Okay. All right, green survives to trade. Penny says, to be honest, I can join you and sleep in class because I really don't have tests tomorrow. <laughs> That's the right attitude that we're trying to promote. Sleeping in school, a man after my own heart. Oh God! You know what? I can tell. Uh, I can tell stream a story about me sleeping in class. I was notorious for sleeping in class. So um, this would have been my OAC year. Could have been grade twelve. Could have been o so OAC was grade thirteen. So we are what is that like 18 at the time um and my high school so i had a biology class first thing um so we're talking like starting oh fuck off hit my four don't hit my four you suck orange um so we're talking this class starts at like 8 15 in the morning um and i've never been a morning person so i sleep in this woman's class every fucking day and i tried everything i could try to like stay conscious and nothing was working um so i'd sleep in her class and i kind of like sort of intimated that it might have been a medical condition so she just didn't bother me about it but quite frankly the teacher was boring as shit um and i like biology i'm, I'm good at the subject and i enjoy it so i find the subject matter interesting it's just uh, she couldn't teach it so <laughs> i'm sleeping through this woman's class and then our our school places like top five in the nation um, in the U of T biology competition. So it's a na nationwide competition for high school students in biology in the subject that I was in her class. And I was one of the top students in the school for, for the test score, helping our, our school place so well nationally. So the teacher looks at me, she's like, I don't even, I don't get it, right? It's like, you know, I didn't think you had it in you, I think is exactly what she said to me. And the joke of it is, it's like, well, it's not because I don't like biology or I'm not good at it. It's like, I think you're boring as shit. Obviously, I didn't say that to her. So, um, yeah. So, green bots. Red bots. We have two bots in this game. Oh, if Orange wants to punch through my troops. Orange can punch through my troops. What I am worried about is Orange taking me out of here and then Magenta killing me dead. Okay. Magenta could do it. It would leave them quite weak, but... Okay, looks like they're going in a different direction. And he says, I mean, the pro I have the problem where I just can't find the motivation to study all that much, right? Well, I don't blame you. I've never learned, I've never really been good at learning that way. Fuck. Magenta is just totally cocked up to kill me. I need this stack to continue to exist kind of at all costs. OK, 
Okay, orange sets in. That stack is gone. Okay, so I see one possible future for me where I don't just die. I have to let Magenta have Australia. Okay, so I lose this, so I'm going to have 24 troops total. No, he doesn't set me up for death! He doesn't set me up for death! Yay! Well, that changes everything. Penny says, I just look if I need a good grade for that subject and then study enough for that. I do. I used to do the same, right? Bare minimum amount of effort. Um, so, fair warning, Panties, if you want to get a philosophy degree and mow lawns for a living, that's the strategy. <laughs> I'm not saying do bad in school, guys. You need to take some things seriously in life. I just, I've never learned that way. Right? I have some kind of mysterious learning disability, so... Um, I can't really read for long periods of time. I was always a bad student. But I'm very interested in learning about what I like learning about. Or go to Africa. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we'll see. We'll see if uh, Magenta can kill me for my fork. Oh, of course I get the fucking the infantry trade. Ooh, this is not looking too good. Magenta in the lead at 49 troops, followed by white at 48. And back. Fuck, he's just waiting to kill me. <laughs> just waiting to kill me. I'm going to lose this now, and then I have to make this meal a whole lot less delicious by trading in and moving out of Magenta's way. Africa's weak, you can get it. Hey, Escape's there. Hello there. How are you, Escape? What's crack a lacking, buddy? Orange takes North American now. Yeah, I have to set. I have to set and get the fuck out of um, Magenta's way. And it's the fucking four set, too. Awful. Who won Escape's tournament? It's not over yet. Final is this Friday. Waiting for Chinese food? Ooh, I'm jelly. I want some Chinese food. What's your go-to Chinese food escape? Let's see if white plays nice with orange. Oh, green is back! Green is no longer a bot. They are back! But they do not break North America. All right, so this is a terrible, terrible play, right? This is my desperation play. I set, do I give up Oz? I don't think this man kills me for one card. Ooh, what I was going to do is I was going to move to India and let him have it. But for him to slam into me for one card is straight suicide. So I think, we hope, Magenta doesn't straight suicide. Marlon Steele. Yeah, he, he's not bad, right? I don't think he just suicides most of his troops, right? I'm, I'm six troops off of this guy. Does he kill me? Yeah, for two cards. I don't think he does. It's not worth it. I don't think he does. But you never know with some people. Does he do it? Okay. <laughs> Woo! 
Woo! <laughs> And he's had to leave the tourney because you needed sleep? Aw, oh, you suck, dude. Stay up all night to play Risk. Um, two cards, yeah. Thank you, Ruman King. We we survived. Uh, waiting on my sesame chicken. That sounds good. Maybe he's waiting for his next set. Yeah, well. Look, I'm in one position. I'm holding Australia. If Magenta wants to suicide into me, he can. Right? It's so funny that... We were talking about players giving up their own game to ruin mine. Um, and <laughs> we very much could see that happen. But in pubs as well. We shall see. I don't know why people are letting orange hold. Yeah, and now Orange has a better guard, not a perfect guard. Alright, Green gonna pump some troops into red, try and establish a Europe position. I hate fucking Australia, man. I can't believe the bot broke me turn one. I would be in this game would be so different. Green weakening the bot moves to take Africa. I see a lot of good neighbor theory here. Ooh, I have alliances off today. I should have them on. I think that was a mistake. Okay, Redbot retakes Africa. The longer this game goes, the worse it is for Magenta. Magenta sets in. I die. Do I die? No. He breaks in North America and goes to sit in a new home. I like that. Move your 45. I love that. Okay. We are back in this game, ladies and gentlemen. Pete, you're the boy who lives so far. So far. It's too bad nobody's dead in this game, but... If I'm stuck in Africa, I'm stuck in... Or if I'm stuck in Australia, I'm stuck in Australia. Okay. Green is punished for not breaking... No, orange doesn't attack. They start, they start grouping. Okay. This is good for white. Part of me wants to take white out of Asia. But then I would worry they just slam through the bots 12 to break me. Green fighting a battle with the bot. Foo-foo. Yeah, I would hope that Orange slams into a Magenta now. That would be two less players in this game. Yeah. 
now I'm starting to come close to the lead. So for having bonus whole game, white is only six troops ahead of me. They, they do have a, a full set worth of cards, but I'm no longer in a fragile weak position. What does Magenta do now? Guarding here makes no fucking sense. What is your plan to win this match? Well, so far my plan has been to survive, which seems to have worked. So now my, yeah, so now I start to think about um, how to win. Um, the next step I would usually do from here is to, to do the split guard. So I'll let someone break me and then move the stack and then split. And then I'm holding China and India as well. Reducing the available space on the board for other people but not necessarily incentivizing anyone to come hit me. Orange in a tough spot. It looks like orange is now um, backed into a corner. They're going to stack. Right. Good. All right. So I think we see orange slam magenta. And that would be great. If orange slam magenta, that would um, remove two of the four players that still exist in this game from the equation. But I do need to catch up to white still. So at some point I would love to remove this entire pocket of white from Asia. Green seems paranoid of orange. Yeah, I don't blame them, but now they've given orange nowhere to get a card. However, orange has shown the willingness to not take cards. Yeah, so what you do from the Australia position is you kind of have to let other people fight a bunch. I'm trying my best not to piss anyone off and stay out of trouble. But we have 25 minutes left in this game, so I hope we are able to round it down to its conclusion before I have to do the 3v3. Well, then again, Penny says he would play, so worst case scenario, Panties can play instead of me. Everyone wants to attack Orange. Is it good for me? Absolutely. Absolutely good for me. Backseat gaming by Pete? Sure. This is also good. Um, nobody opening my big stack it means I just get, get to hold territory in Asia. One sets in with the 10. They're not being given a card by anybody. Poor Orange. Card locked in North America. Does green die? No. Hmm. Yeah, you'll play if necessary. Well, we'll see, right? 25 minutes a long time. We often see these public games end in surprising ways. So. But sometimes they do go for quite a while. Oh my god, Green's going to extend the pissing contest? No, he backs off. Right. That's what you do in that sort of situation. Let's see if I have a card. Let's see if I have cards. Nope. No set on three. This bot is stacking against white. We got a real strong bot there. Can put white in a spot. Remove this pocket. Cost white his Asian position. Oh, 
I'm so curious to see what he, what Orange does to get out of the situation that he's in. If I was Orange, I'd be fuming. White player being very careful not to open me up. He's not willing to hit a six to get a card. Green's thinking about what to do. Yeah, so Magenta has to back off now. I think Orange hits him if he doesn't. Breaks Africa. I was hoping that we'd see this build and slam into white. Okay, green leaps his stack in Madagascar. Or pulls out. Nope, back to Ukraine. All right. have to do anything yet. Maybe I get a set on four. Yeah, nope, no set on four. We wait. Let's see orange slam green, or er, slam magenta. If magenta doesn't have a set, He'll be sitting on five cards. Watch Orange say fuck you for breaking my North America. Yeah, he's going to be sitting on five cards. Ooh, do we see Orange slam into him? Okay, white sitting with a 60 in Brazil, puts a couple extra troops in Asia. Magenta backs off. I'm good. I don't have to do shit yet. We let Orange retake North America. He puts that in Iceland. He puts that right back where it was, which is a terrible place. You're not guarding your bonus. So, so if you want a two-point guard in North America, what you want to do is you want to put some in Mexico and some in Northwest Territories doing the threat guard on both sides. Yo, what's up, Pete? How's it going? The Game Gamer, 71. What's up, buddy? How are you today? Let's see green. Green been hitting the bot. So why are we playing Fixed Friday on Thursday? Because maybe I want to do shit tomorrow, Spudly. Maybe I don't want to just hang out and play my Fixed Friday. I want to make sure that I get the game in. You know what I'm saying? Nah, fuck that. All right. Subverting expectations. You're still awake? I thought you would go to bed by now. Or your sleep schedule all over the place, I bet you.
Fuck, what? What sleep? Hey, it's Relord. How you doing, Relord? How did you do in escapes tournament? Magenta just single stacking, man. Woo hoo hoo! 69 troops! Dab on it. Oh my god, these guys keep fucking with orange. Oh, you're not going to talk about escape turning? What the fuck, real lord? What happened? Now you got to tell me. You can't, you can't tease me like that. You got to tell me what happened. Everybody's still alive. There's four points, meaning you just got smashed every game. You hate to see it, guys. Not to our boy, Relord. <sighs> Red bought with the four trade. Green been trying to keep him in check all game. Seventy two stack. Magenta's not doing shit. Does he finally slam into me? He takes white out. Yes! He does it fucking for me! Oh, I love that! I love that. Let's start a war between white and orange. White doesn't take the bait and goes to zero card. Okay. Spud says it's Thursday, so tonight is PUBG night. Are you streaming PUBG? That's cool. Heasty. I actually I often use your streams to get some sleep because I'm so relaxing. Sorry, I, I'm, I'll try not to get too excited. Escape will. Oh, cool. You're playing with escape. Nice. I don't know what this fucking guy is thinking in in Western United States as a guard position, but it is a dog shit guard position. Why? You, he's you're baffling. Your your play is baffling me, Panda's Revenge, which could be a good thing, right? Anytime I see a player with play I can't predict, it's probably bad for me. So, because uh, Pete is so boring, he puts you to sleep exactly. I try my best to make stimulating risk television for the people. And this is the thanks I get. Well, White is card locked in South America, and I'm about to take the lead in terms of troops. So, actually, you know what's funny? Still tied up with the uh, with the orange player, despite him being fucked with all game. So. At least we've finally taken the lead, ladies and gentlemen. Can't confirm, am getting sleepy. <laughs> but it's true, you have a relaxing voice and some good conversations too from time to time. Well, thank you. Sometimes the conversations are dog shit. But from time to time. Hey man, I'll talk to you guys about whatever you want. Otherwise, we're just watching the paint dry on this classic fix game. <laughs> Until he gets up to yell fuck at the wall. Well, I feel like I yelled fuck at an opportune time. I, I thought that that could have ended my tournament right then and there, you know? So, I did not want to go out round three again. But, you know, I made it to the semis, so we're happy. About, we're happy about the semis, guys. Yeah, that was R3. Exactly. I did not want to go out R3 again. 
<sighs> or R2, which was even fucking worse. Okay, so Orange's 101 troops. They've doubled Magenta. Magenta holding five cards. I think Magenta's living super dangerously. Where are you from, Pete? I am from Toronto. Yeah, I'm happy to share. No, no, I'm from Toronto. I live in Toronto. I never, never left. To be fair, Pete was one bounty away from making the finals. Thank you, Spud. I, I fucking tried so hard, dude. I tried so hard this season. And I got really lucky, too. So I'm, I'm very happy to make it as far as I did. And you know we'll be back again next season, guys. Hope to see you all there. What is your street address and social insurance number? Fuck off. <laughs> hey, man. I am a real person, you know? I live. I work. I enjoy my life. I suppose at some point I should worry about uh, identity theft or whatever the fuck, but uh, you guys would never be mean to me, right, Internet? <laughs> Give me enough bits and find out. Are you forgetting to ask my credit card number? No. Nobody spends my money except my wife. hi -o! <laughs> He's the, I'm a little envious. I bet that's a nice place to live at. Actually, I really want to visit Canada. Well, it was. So... I use, I use was for two real reasons. Um, so I'm 38. I've lived here my whole life. Um, and the winters are, are a bit long. I, I'm, I'm looking to move to somewhere that's a bit warmer. Um, if I never see winter again, it would be too soon. And also, um, the, the government, um, particularly where I live, has been getting worse and worse and worse from the time that we've been getting less and less free. Um, so that is something that I'm concerned about, right? Because I love freedom. As far as it being a nice, safe place to live, yes. Has killed him into my house, yes. Yeah, we've uh, we've hung out a couple times. He's a cool guy. He lives uh, he lives in a city about an hour away. It's less free everywhere. Stop your bitching. That might be true. Like, if the entire world is just getting less free and that's the way it is, then there's nothing to be done. I accept the point. N there is nowhere to go to find freedom. Green is slowly stacking, hitting the bot. Force Magenta to hit a six. Hey, sixty nine troops. Dab on it. Green should stop being a wuss and take Europe. Would you? Would you take Europe with a big ass bot next to you though? Green also bought it out earlier in the game. Double Joker. <laughs> uh, yeah, why not? Okay. Everybody listen to Spud, ladies and gentlemen. Just maintain the bot, yeah. Well, you don't necessarily... You can't necessarily afford to do that in Fixed. 
I guess if you're holding a plus five in Europe, you can. Ah, oh, nice. He hits an easy take there. The name of the game is Risk. All right, white keeps on stacking. I'm now actually in the lead. No, uh, orange in the lead. I'm in second. Orange keep getting fucked with, though. I mean, Green is already maintaining the bond, so why not? Yeah. Why not actually pay it off? Good point. White's being super patient. Yeah, that's a good record. Looks like this game is going nowhere. Why don't you set a custom name for your channel's points? Um, I don't know, because I'm not really handy with any of that stuff. What do you guys want the custom name to be? You gotta do something to create some unbalanced fish game for the three thing. No, I'll let Penny's play. Pete's points. Can I do it easily? Kill piece strategy, rewards and challenges. Manage rewards. Enable channel points. Why well, use channel points? Alright, sell it to me, Twitch. Making the most of channel points. What are the benefits of channel points? For channels with large audiences, we've seen up to an 18% increase in time spent by viewers on their channel. A 13% lift in chat participation amongst their viewers. Why don't you guys just have a fucking conversation with me? You guys want to talk about shit? You guys want to fucking do higher or lower and fucking roll dice? I don't fucking know. It just doesn't. It just doesn't catch me. I guess I'm. I'm a bad producer of video game television. Uh, rage quits, art denier. That's a fun name. What do you mean rage quits? You want me to rage quit? PP. <laughs> Panties can play one game. All right, I'll try and end this. Don't worry. I'll try and end this. Obviously, I'm trying to win. Welcome to Potato Paradise. I've already thought of this. Boo, streamer, give us things. Okay, I will. I will take my top off for a million channel points. <laughs> I want to be 13% more engaged. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. It just it just doesn't it needs to be authentic to me, that's all, right? It has to be something that doesn't seem like I'm pandering. Also, if someone else was willing or able to do this for me, then that would actually get it done a lot quicker because I am the bottleneck for my own work and I spend a ton of time on this so oh we finally see it we finally see it ladies and gentlemen all right we get the suicide we get the suicide from magenta magenta dies and pumps all their troops into orange for orange poor orange having the audacity to try and hold North America I'm not set up to pay off this kill but that is okay I could kill Magenta. Orange goes next. I bet you I don't get to. I think Orange kills Magenta. Does White do it? 
does white get the kill? Once he labels his point, you will expect him to add an image for said points. You all expect him to work. No, guy, I'm happy to work. Don't get me wrong. I'm working. I'm clearly working. I work fucking pretty hard at this project. So the question is, is just how can I more efficiently allocate my time? Orange kills magenta. Fails the 2v1? At the end of the sequence? Fails the 2v1 at the end of the sequence. Feeds it to green. Green gets the kill. This is a feed. Well, maybe Green can't position himself to make the final kill. Ah, he'll just use a 65 stack. Green kills Magenta. Maybe Orange right now. Taking a sweet time to do it, though. Got to break Africa on, on the way. He's not even taking the kill. I get the free kill. Okay, he is taking it. Good. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Imagine being this good. <laughs> Green grows through 24 for the kill. No, no. He goes around. This game is strange. Yeah, well, you see a lot in Classic Fix. You see a lot of stupid shit in Classic Fix. Don't get me wrong. All right, so it's me versus white as the two strongest players. You were hoping you'd hit my 24? At least that would open my 69. I am dumb. Hi. Oh, you just didn't see the path at all? <laughs> you are dumb. Hit orange. Hit orange. Hit orange. Hit orange. Come third. Hit orange. He's not. He's not going to throw. Okay. Okay, I gotta use my wild now. Damn it. All right, let's mobilize our troops. I am in the lead at 134 troops, followed by white at 117 in the in a reasonably distant third is green at 75 troops, followed by the bot at 58, and orange in last place at 43 troops. Orange should die soon. Otherwise, this game could still You missed... <laughs> Hi, Tom, I'm Heasty. <laughs> I totally missed the path. I am ashamed. <laughs> you should be ashamed. Commit seppuku immediately. Poor Orange gets his easy take. Good on him for not quitting, I guess. I guess I'm playing on my phone. Looks like this 3v3 is starting. You guys are going to get to listen to me play 3v3 on my phone while I finish this uh, 
this fixed game. That's going to be intense. We're going to be playing two games at once, guys. I'll just play two games at once. Um... Hey guys. Hello. How are you? Who is I sucks at risk? Is that you? I think that's Spike. Oh. I'm Pete. Oh, I pa meant Panties isn't in the game. I can barely hear you. I can't hear you. I'm pretty silent. Oh, you have to be quiet? I'm raising up the volume. Hey, he's in the game. All, All right, right. Cool. yay. Good luck, guys. Yep, good luck. from Bhutan. <laughs> the Bhutan boys. <laughs> the Bhutanian brothers. Oh, they go first, oh, second, and third? I think this is a restart. Oh, shit, you're not... Wait. Looks like a restart. Yeah, it's a restart. Yeah. Okay. And we're out. Bro, I'm in such a good position. <laughs> so one of my uh, viewers gave, gave me the idea for 3v3. He says, a good idea for 3v3 is you want to... Um, target the first player of them in the sequence. Like, if all three of us hit... I was thinking about that, too. Yeah. What do you think? Does it, do, do you want to try it? I think that's a good strategy. I was just like, we need to all go it's after somebody, somebody first. Okay, cool. Yeah. Cool. I like that idea. You guys just tell me what you want me to do. I will be your sword. Because I think, oh, I think we did well last time. It just... The dice really fucked us. Yeah, the dice really <laughs> fucked us. <laughs> it's a true story. <clears throat> All right. Maybe two of us will go first and not three, and we can bust somebody's ass. You can't hear me, panties? Well, that's not me, Pete. Do you hear me? Yeah, I hear you fine. Okay. Oh, okay. bro, I was oh, looking, shit. Oh, I was looking on Discord. Yeah. Four times a charm. Sorry. Fuck's sake. <laughs> My bad. Third time's a charm? Okay, let's do this. Oh, I cannot be red. You can take red, Pete. Oh, thank you. Purple. All right. Ready? Out. Okay, ready up. Yeah, I go first. You guys just tell me what you want me to do. Are we going to target... Who's the first one? Sterling? Do you want to target Sterling? 
Oh, yeah, let's do that. Blue. Okay, we'll all go for. Uh, for blue. I'll go for blue. Yeah. Okay. Let's, can everybody see the board now? Or wait, who's pink? We don't want them to get that continent. Right. Yeah, just hit me. Showing me weird shit on the board. Okay, there we go. Yeah, right, please turn. And where am I? Oh, I have a five. Put it all on the five and hit up and then take out his blue three. If he doesn't. If... Oh, nice. Oh, hell, nice. Good dice. Good dice. Good dice. Yeah, this will hurt him. Let's see if it hurts him enough that we can actually. Finish yeah, the job. See yeah. where he puts his troop. We got him under twelve. I think it's a reasonable good theory to test, right? Just target the, I think so the, too. the first one of them to act. I thought about that. Um, like a day later, I was like, I wonder what would happen if we all just targeted the same person. Yeah, you were stewing on us getting our ass kicked so bad, too. <laughs> uh, no, I was thinking about it, and it, we didn't play bad. I don't think we played all that bad, I no. Mean, I fucked up one time, not fortifying back to my cap, sure. which totally mm -hmm. lost mm -hmm. the game. But, okay, so he mm -hmm. put him mm -hmm. there. All, of all right. Way. I'm going to get what? So he doesn't get the 12. I'm gonna bust his three up. I'm, oh wow, I'm gonna bust all of them. Ooh, he lost oh, that three v one. Lose those three v ones. Lose those three v ones. All right. Sterling is looking weak as fuck. Yeah, he is. I'm going to bust his eyes. Look at Misty's five stack in the bottom. Okay, it's like getting a couple hits on you. Can't take a lot of me. You want to focus on um, stunning a lot, like hard, hard. So I put one on my five and. Heroes, but she needs to attack green. Yeah. I need to do what? Yeah. You need to hit green. He's going to get a lot of troops. Oh, we're on a mission to kill blue, right? Yeah, I'm so happy with this. He's he's like in big trouble now. Yeah. Let's see what Olive does. <clears throat> how many troops you guys have? Oh, it's seventy percent. It doesn't say. Or yeah, rather, I, how many territories do you guys have? Do you know? I don't know. I have twenty percent. Oh, he left VC. I don't. There he is. Mine just says twenty percent and seventeen for. Oh, you can see with it. Uh, um, I have 15 territories. So That's 15 good. 15 is, is good. Let's see who all have hits. Hits you both. How many do you have, Panties? 16%. 19, 19 troops. Uh, right, he's taking a bite on everyone. Really, All yeah, right, we so gotta... so if we kill Sterling or hurt Sterling, Olive is going to have a lot of territory. 
but yeah. they have effectively one less player. Are you guys down with that? I can hit all of a lot. Who can hit all? Do, do you want me to hit Sterling really hard still? Yes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Sterling, I'll hit all of I think we should test it out. I think it's a yeah, good theory. I'm, I'm if down. they're down to two people, that's one third of the troops they would have okay, had. Okay, so in. I just got I just got four Sterling territories, so I'm pretty happy with that. Yeah. Okay, we'll go from there. You could take his two up top, and then that leaves him, what, that two and that one in the west? I also have the bonus, so if they just somehow don't break me, then that will be hilarious. What is Erling going to do? I think he's got three territories. He's going to hide over there. Mm -hmm. This side. Okay, so Spike breaks, but I still have four stack in the middle of the board. That's nice and mobile. Okay, can any of you guys get to his four, or is that just me? Um, I can. I have a two, but I won't be able to take his four. Top, get five. Two on the top. So, okay. Yeah. Well, so I'm thinking I can get to the two in the top. Um, but it all depends. Mm -hmm. it. Hit the one. Or actually, maybe we need to hit all of. Do what you want to do. Looks good. Okay. Okay. Yep, I like it. I like we've we've actually eliminated one of their players. That seems like a pretty successful test of the theory. Yeah. Okay. Keep hitting? What do you guys um, think? I would say yes. Green, green, hit all, hit all of it. Hit all so of he's it. got only that oh, four left. Oh, he's going to have a total of seven. He's going to... Oh, Got that he had two other territories over there. Beep. What up? In River Watch, I just want a piece of Sterling. I have a set on three. I think I kill Sterling. Yes. Look, I found another piece of Sterling. Look. Yeah, he found two other territories that he had. Oh shit, okay. 
He killed one of them. He's got another one on the island. Pete, Pete, you hit stoning with your son on the three, I finished stoning. Where? Where do you want me to hit him? Left, top left. I'll have a two there. They don't remove that. Which I doubt. So, set in. Add to my two in the top left and try and hit Sterling? Yeah. Okay. Yep. okay. Because we're like both first and second, so I can finish him off if needed. Right. They're taking me out so I can't hit blue. Now green's gonna hit my ones there, but no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna still go after Sterling's team. But Doing all right. I have a set. Okay. Ooh, nice roll. Hit pink, hit pink, hit pink. Hit pink? Yeah, yeah, Okay. And the olive is hit. Olive. Keep going? Not that cock, I hit. Save the three? Yeah. Okay. Nice. Bye bye, Sterling. I think that was a good strategy. Yeah. I'm going to have to set on three. <laughs> so should I save my set? What is this? Progressive or progressive? Okay. All right. Should we just target another one then? I just smack well, Now it's up. 3v2, so we, yeah. we have an inherent advantage. You got cards, Misty, you said? I, I do have a set. Well, who's weaker of the two? Or who's accessible to you that you can remove from a pocket? I think we can remove green. Ah, they just traded. Okay, so Spike's going to hit you Sounds hard or panties? Not sure. Or a little every. No, he's hitting you. Okay. Okay. All right, so I'll just yeah, cards. go to the southeast and take out all of green right there. I like I like the the left better. Can you take all of green yeah, out, yeah. out of the left? Take green all out of the left. Yeah, because okay. it's a single path, right? 
No, oh, so yeah. you do have to split there too. Fuck. Um, there's just more of him on the left. Is what I'm thinking. And then if he doesn't have a set on three, then Spike might have to kill him for his cards. Maybe. Yeah. Just punch him a lot in the left. I'm gonna set in right. So we can maybe take out all of them. Mm. This is good. I like this a lot. He came in with, like, a coherent plan. No set, no set, no set. No set. We focus all of... Fuck. Fuck. Oh, well. Fuck, 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 I'm gonna get the 15 right. Yeah, I was about to say, Panties is looking pretty with those four cards, so he's going to get a... Got a match. Yeah. We can come back. Who do you want to weaken is the question. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I think I think when we try to be not weak, all of us might be kind of killer. I got a set. Okay. Suggestions. It's Spike, it's Spike. Pick the bonus top left. Hitting Spike. Bonus. Taking bonus. And hit all of once. Yep. You happy with that? Yep. Perfect. What I'm gonna do is be a cunt. That looks like you about to fuck shit up. That's what I like to see. <laughs> yes, yeah, so we got a big trade. Ooh la 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 la. That she is, isn't it? Yeah, get him. I like this. Yeah. This. Nice. Eat, look at the, to the top right. <laughs> All you. <laughs> I think this is GG. I can't really do anything. He doesn't even break you top left, he can't. Hm? He's gonna be going out of there in a minute anyway. And I can leave my five right there. Yeah, we've just given them too many problems. Perfect. That this was a great plan. And it was a really good execution too, so well done. Let's see, let's I no let's just win let's just win this damn game. Who's easier to kill now? Spike, right? Pink. Yes, fuck. Where am I? Did you weaken Spike so I'm able to kill him? Am I gonna trade him probably? I'll hit him as hard as I can, man. Oh, Pete, you can take him out right there by your... Oh, Misty Nixon as well. So I don't have to split. Yeah, good. Good job. Looks good. Excellent work. Oh. I'm gonna just stay there. Yes, the plan remains the same. You just hit Spike as much as you can. Yeah, Pink's, a, Pink's a, about to bite the dust. The market. It was true. And clean up on our nine. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice nine. 
Yay! Oh, I can stream for you, Stony. Thank you, thank you. We we did a new plan this time. Pete um, actually said that somebody suggested to him we just focus on one person. And I was thinking about that after our last games. We focus on one person and take them out. And so we took Sterling out first, and it's been working. It wasn't just focus on one person. It was focus on the first one of them to act. Specific. Yeah. It was focused on a specific Actually, person. Yeah. Actually, a smart plan. It was. Well, no. Thank you. Uh, I'll look up the. I'll look up the YouTube, um, commenter who who made the suggestion. But uh, yeah, worked out very well. I'm happy. I'll tell you playing like general like v twos and one and three v three. I think you can take. Well, no. I have to. I'll take that one. Yeah, I'll go for seventy percent. Don't we want to kill all of first? Don't we get more points that way? We have to kill. Let's kill all of them. Yeah, first. I think we get more we points if we. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll kill all if I get a trade and right. So a huge amount. Right, I'll, help, I'll help feed. I'll help feed the kill. Um, you. I do not have a set. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. GG. GG. Ooh. Hey. Nice. Roll. Damn. Do you have to get 70% now, uh, Bull, or is it game over since we're all alive? Yeah, he'll get it right. He can get it this turn. Oh, okay. It, 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 it doesn't matter. He says, GG, we left the game? Okay, cool. Hey. Good game. Hold on. Good game. Yeah. Can you play again, Panties? <laughs> it sounds like he's falling asleep. <laughs> uh, he never showed up. Oh my god. We could look for a villain, maybe. Yeah, I, if if Panty's falling asleep, then. Uh... Okay. No, no, I can play one more. You can play one okay, more. Yes, Amazing. Yes, Amazing. Yes. Okay, cool. All right, are you gonna stream this, Misty? No, I'll, I'm just streaming it for uh, Stony and Bull. Okay. And multi back in the I'm Discord. That's all. Stream it. Mm -hmm. I'm stroking. You're stroking, huh? <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. Sick. All right, hold on. I'm, I'm doing too many things at once. Um, and jump in the shower, okay? Okay. Shower my door, please. Um, okay, so what I'm going to do for the second game, guys, is I'm actually going to just stream Misty stream, so you can watch the 3v3, and I, I feel bad for anyone who's invested in the outcome of this fixed game. I am going to still try and win, but uh, right now it looks like it's it's going on for a while, so let's just uh, let's just okay. switch to Misty's... Okay. Okay. There's Misty, and then what do I do? I go... And then you join the game. I will join the game. game. I'm definitely going to bed, though, by the way. Alright. You want there's black for you, uh, panties. Do we try to uh, maybe find a villain if Fiji doesn't? Show? Yes. In the meantime, if you could. Yep, I can do that. Yeah, I'm doing too many things at once, Don't guys. Sorry. That's all right, Pete. Start the game yet? I need to look. 